Though Nigeria is not listed among cocaine producing countries, it is named among the transit point on cocaine routes, Latin America, the Caribbean, West Africa, through Europe. As traffickers are building and networking clandestinely to enrich their illicit trade, so most nations and their law enforcement agencies build capacities to identify, investigate, gather evidence to effectively prosecute drug trafficking and other related organized crimes. Inspector General of Police, represented by Deputy Inspector General of Police, Hyson Dangala said, the time to act is now using Interpol tools. The Nigerian Police Force will continue to collaborate with the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency and other national agencies in its quest to ensure a crime-free border crossing using the Interpol tools in the fight against illicit drug trafficking and organized crime nationally and within the sub-region. Between 2006 and 2015, uh, the agency has made a seizure of about 17,612.94 kilograms of cocaine. So this tells you the magnitude of the problem. This is an opportunity for cross fertilization of ideas because we need the in improved interagency relationship. The training is supported by the European Union and the United Nations Office on Drugs and Crimes. In the last two years, over 22 tons of cocaine were seized en route from South America via West Africa to Europe in different countries. So this training is just to prepare all of them in order for them to be able to work together, to know again how to operate these tools, how to access the databases that are provided by Interpol. For the next eight days, the participants drawn from various law enforcement agencies such as the police, EFCC, NDLEA, and customs will be engaged in sharpening their skills in cocaine investigation and prosecution with a common goal of a world less affected from organized drug trafficking. In Abuja, Edina Justice, NCA News.